when you, you, you get into the salsa community, you become part of a big family that is all over the world. They come together to dance, they come together just to socialize, to have fun, to meet people, to relax, to escape, to for therapy. As Latinos, we tend to be close. Um, even when we say hello to each other, we hug, we kiss, you know, and, and so you, you don't stop doing those things when you're introducing people to dance. They end up connecting with other people just by holding hands with somebody is a major thing. And I don't think people realize how, how important the touch of another person is. So that gives them the opportunity without them thinking too much about it. It's amazing how Latin dance brings people from so many different cultures, age, religion, race. Um, you can come into a room and I'm amazed that there is everything from Asian to black to mixed to Spanish, anything. It brings everybody together and it brings that sense of belonging. Because in American culture, it's, it's a facade, it's a materialism and this a false identity and who do you appear to be. It's like a very judgment-free zone, if that makes sense. Through the dance, in our dance group, uh, people have been able to meet, um, which have led to a lot of uh, marriages and engagements. So I had been coming, I'd been dancing at the studio, and I never thought I'd meet someone there. I just <laughs> would come by myself. <laughs> no makeup, hair up in a bun, just relax clothes, just to get a good workout, because Latin dance says that too. And then one day, I came here, and he was there. <laughs> that something that I just love doing, that we could meet doing that. I think that's a beautiful thing. You didn't have to go out and search for it. You didn't have to go out and find love. It, you just, Latin dance brought it all together for us.